Having visited the area, it's clear to see there's a vast need for change. My design proposal is to change the existing unwelcoming area into a vibrant community orientated area for people of all ages. As Yang Gao said, complementing areas with furniture and using soft edges creates some of the most vibrant areas of a city. I believe this is a key concept for the redevelopment of this area. Hartford Street is currently a very unwelcoming street with priority given to cars. I propose to make this street all about the people and make it a more vibrant area by stopping all vehicular access. Here I propose to keep the old school building and transform the area around it into a mixed purpose area for the community. With Barnet Street, Golden Road and Silver Road, I propose to simply create level surfaces all over with no curbs. This is in order to keep the speed down and allow the people to feel in control. I propose to incorporate the use of vegetation and better lighting to lift the vitality of this area. Essex Street also lends itself to the surface levelling to create a safer place. Here where the primary school playground was, I proposed to put eight two-bedroom houses. These would hopefully sell for around £300,000 each, which will help fund the development of the area as a whole. Phase one of the development focuses on the construction of houses on the old school playground facing out to Essex Street. This will in turn pay for the other proposed developments. The front of the proposed development will face out to Hartford Street. This is a street I wish to completely pedestrianise. The school building will now be turned into a large community hall. Creating the kids playground and the green space opens up this area to all age groups. Next to the community centre there is proposed to be a cafe. This is for all ranges of people to come and enjoy. Here there is more open space and an area for kids to come and play. Finally, this is going to be a gym facility, which is much needed in this area. This will also encourage people to keep active. Overall, this development is aiming to bring the community together by creating a varied range of places to go and things to do. To conclude, on review of the design proposal, I strongly believe that the development ideas suggested allow great potential to vastly improve the area and make it into a strong, community orientated area of East Oxford and also make a great contribution to the area as a whole. So what do you think?